Hi, my name is Dan, and this is Novalco Basics. Today we're taking a look at Navalco's magnetostrictive and capacitive transmitters. Let's begin with the most accurate of them all, the Nivatrack magnetostrictive transmitter. It uses the magnetic field of a float sliding along a hollow stem containing a waveguide made from a ferromagnetic material. The assembly is suspended in a measured liquid. As the float moves, the field of the permanent magnet inside the float changes the alignment of the magnetic molecules of the waveguide in the stem. The electronics of the device produces electromagnetic pulses at predetermined intervals. The pulse travels down the waveguide, creating its own magnetic field. When the pulse reaches the float, the conflicting magnetic fields create a torsional stress wave or strain pulse in the waveguide that propagates back up the waveguide at the speed of sound. The strain pulse is detected by the electronics, which converts it into an electronic signal. The Nivatrack is a two-wire device with optional hard communication and programming in a 4 to 20 milliamp loop. The Vacos magnetostrictive transmitters can also be used with a plug-in display to read the values and configure the instrument locally. The device is available with a flexible or rigid, coated or naked stem, with or without a process connection and with a plastic or metal flow. There is a mini version available as well. The device's highest resolution is plus minus 0.1 mm, not to be confused with accuracy which is about 0.5 mm for an instrument with a plus minus 0.1 mm resolution. The highest medium temperature is 194 degrees Fahrenheit. The loop current can be measured on a 10 ohm resistor installed in series with the output. The voltage measured on the resistor is proportional to the loop current. The terminals of the resistor are connected to the terminal block so that the loop current can be measured without severing the loop. The integrated variant is the development of the last few years for environments where no local displaying is needed and small size is crucial. There are numerous integrated variants available for different mediums and vessels. Nivatrack magnetostrictive transmitters were designed for applications where extreme accuracy is a must, like the chemical industry, distilleries, food and beverage industry, and the oil and gas industry. Magnetostrictive devices shine when it comes to the custard transfer metering of flammable liquids, solvents, and hydrocarbons, but there must be no particular contamination in the medium. Nivatrack transmitters are often used together with Nivaflip bypass level indicators. The floatless version is actuated by the magnet inside the Nivaflip's float. The mini version for small tanks has almost no dead zone at all. Now let's take a look at the capacitive operating principle. The tank, the medium, and the probe together form a capacitor. The tank and the probe are the electrodes, while the medium acts as the dielectric. As the level changes, so does the capacitance of the capacitor. The level, volume, and weight values are calculated from the capacitance of the system. If the tank's walls are non-conductive, they are substituted by an auxiliary probe. The high temperature and EX certified models are suitable for hazardous environments and power generation applications. 
The probes of capacitive transmitters cannot be shortened afterwards, because the FEP coating must be intact for the device to function correctly. It's important to know that these transmitters have the best reaction times, so they are often used in applications where the level changes quickly. The loop current can be measured with a multimeter on these devices as well. Novaco also manufactures transmitters with a partially coated probe, but they can only be used with certain sufficiently clean, non-conductive media. These days we mostly recommend fully coated probes for such media as well. The Nivacap is a typical level measuring device for the water tank of steam generators. This operating principle requires the medium to be homogeneous and that its dielectric constant is at least 1.5. If the tank's walls are non-conductive, a reference probe must be installed. Nivacap transmitters are fast, accurate and easy to install. They can be used in applications with rapid level changes and high pressures. However, a change in the composition of liquids or in the moisture content of solids may decrease the accuracy of the system. Conductive deposits on the probe may lead to measurement errors. Thank you for watching. The presentation was compiled by Laszlo Chomor and we hope it will help you find the right device.